Hey YouTube, this is Jaden coming at you with a video. Um, today I'm going to be talking, um, if you watched uh, segment 23 of Cards That Make My Dick Hurt, um, you saw that it I, was the first one that I uh, introduced reverse units. Um, and um, what reverse units are, like I said in that video, is they're kind of like a knockoff of Link Joker. They're, they have ties to Link Joker clan, but they're, they still maintain the clan that they originally belonged to. Like, um, for example, um, if this card was originally a Royal Paladin, if it is a reverse card, it is not a Link Joker now. It is still a Royal Paladin card. Um, I, um, if you have not watched that segment, go watch that, and you'll find out which specifically reverse unit I talk about. Um but in that video, I also said that I have never, I haven't talked about anything Link Joker yet. And the reason was, is I was kind of putting it off because I wanted to kind of get some ideas flowing in my head to make a video of it. And this is kind of, you know, just an, an informative video to kind of introduce you to what Link Joker is. Now, Link Joker is a clan that was released into, uh, was, that was introduced into set three. Um, it is the antagonist's clan. It is, it's kind of like the evil warriors from outer space. That's the best way I can put it. Um, they also have, um, their own trial deck. Let me, uh, I have it pulled up here. It was released in Japan on June 22nd of 2013. Huh, June 22nd. That's actually my mom's birthday. Huh. But anyway, um, it, um, and it's also when we saw the first, uh, uh, Link Joker kind of boss card which was the break ride for link joker which is star vader infinite zero dragon i have it pulled up here in front of me i'm going to read it to you just real quick um auto limit break four when a link joker rides this unit choose one of your opponent's rear guards in the front row and back row lock them choose your vanguard and that unit gets plus 10,000 power until the end of turn and when this card attacks a vanguard this unit gets plus 2,000 power now, you might be asking yourself, if you're still relatively new to the game, what does lock mean? Well, <clears throat> I'm going to show you really quickly kind of what lock is, um, because, you know, if you've watched the show, then you should already know what lock is, but I'm going to post it up here. I don't know why I'm flipping through all my cards like I'm looking for a specific one, um, um, but... Uh, so, you know, that way you can just see what lock is, you'll know it when you see it, um, and, you know, I, it'll at least be clarified on here what lock is. Okay, so first off, you have a card, and I'm showing you my uh, Majesty Japanese that I got from my friend Darian. Uh, so, anyway, guys, what lock is, like, if you read Star Vader Dragon, let me read it to you one more time. Uh, when a Link Joker rides this unit, choose one of your opponent's rear guards in the front row and back row, lock them, and then your Vanguard gains 10,000. But, okay, so what lock means is, okay, say normally you have, I don't know why I have Aggravain here, but we'll just say, for instance, let's say this is your column, all right? What lock is is when you take those cards and you turn them over like this. This is what lock is. Um, when a card is locked, it is literally frozen. It can't move. It can't, like, move from the front to the back row. It can't be retired. It can't attack. It can't boost. It can't rest. It can't stand. It's literally just frozen. And, um, it remains like this. Pretty much all the card does is flip over. That's all it, that's all that happens. Um... So that, 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 that's pretty much it. It just goes from this to this. And again, literally, excuse me, the card is literally just there. It's just frozen in space. And what Link Joker lives off is they live off their ability to nurse this lock ability and use it to win games because it literally f can freeze a whole row or make your opponent's attack so weak that they're not going to be able to do much. Now, when I very first saw Lock, you know, like most people, when you see something new like this, you're like, wow, that's amazing. You know, this is going to be really good for the game. But, 
you know, the only problem with this is, um, I, I hate to play devil's advocate here because, I mean, I don't know how popular Link Joker is, but I know specifically there's a lot of noise and buzz about it from my locals, and there's a lot of buzz from that I've seen around, like, um, on the internet. Um, so, I, I mean, I hate to play devil's advocate here, but, I, but I'm going to. Um, Link Joker is a clan that if you have to be very careful with it because if you use your lock abilities at the wrong time it really can cost you the game because keep in mind all of these lock abilities they're gonna cost you a pretty good amount of counter blast normally anywhere from one to two and they're also gonna cost you normally some field advantage because you're gonna have to dedicate something to your what your opponent what you're locking on your opponent um, that might sound really weird, and I may have not worded that exactly the right way, um, because I, I'm kind of in a, you know, I mean, I have a friend at my locals, his name and his name's Andrew, and he's just batshit crazy about Link Joker, um, and I share his uh, like uh, his enthusiasm because I really like Link Joker because I really like dragons, um, but I'm like yeah on it because. I mean, I certainly see Link Joker being a top deck. Do I see it being in contention to maybe be the universal top deck? Not really, because as good as the lock ability is, um, you know, some people thought, well, is the Link Joker deck going to be the only deck that has access to this ability? But then we're seeing all these reverse units come out, Vowing Saber Reverse Dragon, Dayusha reverse, Amon reverse, Lukie reverse, you know, we're seeing all these different reverse units and um, that are still part of their original clan, but they're still getting to use the lock ability. So that's where you get your units that are have their touch of Link Joker in them, like Lukie reverse for Pale Moon. It's still a Pale Moon Grade 3 Lukie. Um, that just looks evil, um, but it has its ties to Link Joker because it makes uh, use of the lock ability. And the lock ability on these cards, they'll either be used on your opponent to weaken them, or you'll lock your own units to gain extra strength. Um, and there's many different variations of it, and you know, you might be <clears throat> a Link Joker fan, you might be a Link Joker hater, you know, you just got to kind of fit, find out where you fit in that category. I'm a Link Joker fan. I think the clan will be a lot of fun. It'll be something new. Um, you know, you just got to remember when a unit becomes locked, it just literally freezes. It's just like it's there, you know. Um, um, out of all the lock abilities that I've seen so far, they're all really good. I still don't think, you know, I think Bush Road right now, they're still holding that one ace in the hole that is going to make everyone go, wow, I'm definitely going to build Link Joker now if you're still on the edge. I know me personally, I will be building Link Joker. But, um, you know, there's a lot of people um, I'd like that maybe that you know, they're just like, yeah, I think I'll just stick to the Liberators, I'll just stick to the Eradicators, I'll just stick to the Revengers, I'll just stick to the Dimensional Robos, you know, or Genesis, or Great Nature, or Dark Irregulars, or Pale Moon, or whatever floats your boat, but, <clears throat> you know, the reverse cards are all really good, you know, I'm going to be doing probably a few more of them on cards that make my dick hurt, because they're all really good effects, um, I mean, Amon Reverse, Pale, um, Lukie Reverse, and Vowing Saber Reverse is really good, um, ironically though, I think Vowing Saber Reverse Dragon is the worst out of the four that I just named, but <clears throat> they all have their uses, they all have their strengths, they all have their weaknesses, just like every card does, they all have their right place. But anyway guys, this has just kind of been a short discussion about Link Joker, it is, um, if, in a nutshell, you know, I explained this in my last segment of cards that make my dick hurt, so go check that out, I'll put that link to the in the just comments in the description below so please go check that out pretty much you know if you ever collected pokemon cards back in the day you're going to exactly get what i'm saying here you remember when there was like blastoise okay the blastoise card and then you had dark blastoise okay it's kind of that thing it's going to be like okay you got silverthorn dragon tamer lukie and then you got evil lukie you know or reverse lukie it's pretty much the same term.
<coughs> so that's where it comes from as the reverses. It's just taking these units and making them evil. Because I'm not going to spoil the anime for you. I'm not going to tell you who becomes evil or whatever that. It pretty much just... Link Joker, it pretty much takes a good thing and makes it evil, or a good person and makes them evil. So, if you want to find out more about Link Joker, I suggest you watch Season 3 of Vanguard. You can find it all over YouTube, and there's probably other sites where you can watch it too. So, anyway guys, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. Tell me in the comment section below what your feelings are on Link Joker. Do you like the clan? Do you hate the clan? Are you going to build it, or are you going to do everything you can to avoid it? <clears throat> so, um, as far as... The Wikia, they haven't released any kind of information of like when it's going to even be released in America. It was released June 22nd in, a in Japan. Um, if I had to guess, because we're getting set Trial Decks 8 and 9 in October, um, and then we'll get uh, the Revengers and this one after that. I would guess then we would probably get the, well, just for fun real quick, I haven't checked, maybe there has been an update to it, I'll go to the front page of the wiki and we'll just find this out. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, there still hasn't been a release yet. Um, um, wait, 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 wait. Nope, there has not. Um, but if I had to guess, I would guess that this trial deck be, would be released in January. Um, would be my best guess. Maybe January, maybe February. Um, because the last release that we know that is confirmed for um, America is uh, December 13th for set 10. Um, because remember, set 11 and 10 got switched on us. So... We don't, that's the last confirmed date of something released in the States that we know for is December 13th. So my best guess would be you'll see the Revenger trial deck and the Link Joker trial deck, which is called, do, 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 the Link Joker trial deck is called Star Vader Invasion. So I would be looking to see that be released in the state somewhere around january or february so anyway guys i hope this was informative i hope you understand a little bit more about link joker than you did when you watch this video unless you you know pretty much knew everything you knew need to about it like me when you watch the animes or you've read about it but if you haven't here you go here's pretty much all the information that there is on link joker right now um and their new ability that's been introduced on into their clan and as well as spaced out between other clans the ability lock if you have any questions feel free to private message me i'll be more than happy to answer any question that you have um please leave in the comment section below again what your feelings are on this deck um, I will, you will see more, um, segments on specific cards from Link Joker. I wanted to have this video posted before I did anything else on the clan. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later.